Hey, what is up guys? Bonfiggy here, and today I got a pretty insane gameplay for you guys. It's actually 143 kills with the FAL, and you guys are probably sitting there looking at the title of the video wondering, you know, what's so special about this gameplay. And in case you guys are wondering, I actually was getting a lot of gun kills and I was playing really aggressive with the FAL a lot of times. People like to play passive with this, but the thing that really stands out about this gameplay that, you know, I just really wanted to upload it right away for you guys is the fact that I died one off of my lethal kill streaks four times. I think I get three sets of kill streaks all together and then four times I go, I get a blackbird and then I die one off of my dogs or one off of my swarm and it just sucked because that's good for about at least 80 kills so I definitely would have had a 200 plus kill game and it just sucks because it was right there at the tip of my tongue I know there's a big difference between 143 kills and you know 200 kills but the fact that I died one off of my lethal kill streaks four times in this gameplay makes it really special to me and I just thought it actually made for more entertaining gameplay I think this would be more entertaining than if I would have gotten a 200 plus because you know, if I would have gotten those kill streaks, first of all, I wouldn't have gotten nearly as many gun kills. And second of all, it just would have been me running around the map waiting for my kill streaks to do all the work for me. But, you know, I want to talk a little bit about the FAL because it's actually a really good weapon. This along with the SMR, they're really good if you want to throw on the full auto. I was using that, and I believe I was using extended mags as well. I'm not quite sure. This gameplay was a little bit old, but definitely try the FAL with the auto fire because it actually works out really well. I didn't really like the semi-automatic weapons and all the other Call of Duties. You know, there was the MK14, and the reason why I didn't like them was because of the fact that, you know, you had to keep on pounding your trigger, and it really messed up my aim. That's the thing, and now it's like a automatic gun with a ton of damage it's insane so if you guys haven't tried out this weapon i really recommend you guys hop on and do so it can get some really good gameplays i can tell you that right now and you can also play really aggressive i think i might have been using quick draw in this gameplay actually i'm not quite sure because you know it's an assault rifle i like to use that either quick draw extended mags definitely use the rapid fire or auto fire whatever you want to call it and i would also recommend using stock if that's something you guys like but Definitely a really solid weapon. Don't really see a need to use a silencer on this weapon. It just kind of decreases the uh, damage a little bit. So I wouldn't recommend that. I just would recommend using it with something you're comfortable with. But I thought I might share this gameplay with you guys and let you know a little bit about this weapon. And I'm sure you guys have always been mowed down by something like this. And maybe you just never tried it. I don't know. But I thought I might mention that. Uh, a little update on my car. I know I've been doing a couple videos on this. And I always mention it like weekly. But I finally worked out the deal with the dealer for my car. I'm actually getting a 2012 Camaro SS, and it has this really sweet Transformers Edition. And that might sound kind of nerdy. I mean, it's the Transformers Edition, but it looks sick. It looks exactly like the uh, Camaro from the Transformers 3 movie. Uh, you guys can Google it if you want or something like that. I'll be doing a proper car video. I'm supposed to be picking it up probably in two weeks, and I cannot wait. I'm so excited. And speaking of cars... I actually got a drive home today, which was really cool because, you know, I'm 14 years old. But my mom, she was, like, passed out or something because she's been going all day. She had back surgery, and she just wasn't doing too well. She had to pick me up, but she wasn't feeling too good. And she was, like, veering off the road, so I'm like, Mom, just let me drive. And that was a really cool experience for me anyways. But anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed the video. Just went on a little bit of a ramble. Make sure to check out this weapon if you guys haven't tried it out already. Uh, definitely a really solid weapon if you guys just want to try something new. But yeah, that's pretty much it. If you guys could leave a like on this video, I'd really appreciate it. I thought it was a really great gameplay. And I'll try to get some more like this if you guys want me to. But that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'm out. Peace.